Hello YouTube, Real Shooting here, and in today's video, we're going to be fishing a new pond. This pond is actually new to me, I've never fished it. I actually live in this neighborhood, we just moved here recently. And uh, I saw online, people posted that they do catch bass in here. This is a catch and release only pond. This area here is very shallow, but I think as you walk farther that way, it gets deeper. But as I was walking here, I see a lot of blow-ups, and there's like fish waking. You can see the wakes right there if that shows up on camera. I'm gonna start off by fishing the Z-Man. This is the Finesse TRD. I believe this color is Mood Ring. It's like a purple to like a grayish blue. And I brought up only one rod and a couple of soft plastics. So either the Ned Rig or we're gonna fish a Texas Rig. I brought those basically because I didn't know if there was gonna be a lot of grass in here or not. And there is. So hard baits really wouldn't do it unless we fish deeper. I'm gonna try with the Ned Rig real quick down here. You guys stay tuned. You guys, now we're talking. This is a bigger pond right here. Very deep. I don't know if they are connected though. I think so. Let's cast ahead of us. Wow. This is where we're going to be fishing. There we go. Oh, that's grass. Oh no, it's a fish. We got one. Very little bass. I thought we were in the grass, you guys. First fish of the day. He's gonna shake. Oh. Pretty nice. We'll take it. At least we know there's fish here now, you guys. How long did that take? About 20 minutes. It's 540 now. Very little bass on the Ned Rig. Pretty healthy. I thought we got snagged on some grass. There's a lot of grass down here. And this fish was hiding in there. We're gonna let him in now. There he goes. As you guys can see, my first time at this pond, we already caught one in 20 minutes. That's the trick of the Ned Rig, you guys. I'm gonna try that again. I cast it real shallow over here. But there's a ton of grass where this water's being pushed that way. That little fish bit it. I thought we were snagged. But it started going off to the right. That's when you know you're not snagged. I'm just curious if we can get one more bite out of here again. Oh, something took off. fish they might be loaded right here but there might be some just small ones right here there we go there we go there we go oh that one's a little better yep that one's better bass number two of the day you guys wow look where he's hooked bottom of the mouth There we go, nice little fish. Looks like he's been hooked before on top of the mouth. Very thin bass. I'm gonna let him go right here. There he goes. I don't think they're gonna be this shallow. It's real shallow, but I'm trying to parallel the bank. Oh, there we go, there we go, we got one. Wow, look at that fish go. What? That is a big bluegill, you guys. That is a big bluegill. <laughs> that is crazy. Take off my little bag right here. I'm gonna get a quick picture of this too. That is big. 
No, he just came off. I won't take a picture. We'll just show him on the video. There he is, you guys. That is crazy. He bit the net rig. Very nice colors. Wow. You guys, that was pretty cool. That is a big bluegill. When I saw the colors, I knew it wasn't a bass. I wasn't sure what that was. That is exciting. We found a pretty good pond here. And I'm within walking distance of it. Let me talk about that catch for a little bit. I'm paralleling the bank right here and I was just swimming it along the bank. A little bit out there though because you want to be a little deeper. It gets real shallow like right here is just a couple of inches. And I guess that, that bluegill saw it. He chased it and he bit that thing quick. Oh that bass jumped for it. You have got to be kidding me you guys. Y'all saw that? The lure was already coming out of the water. And he jumped for it. Hooked on top of the mouth. Very aggressive bass, you guys. How many bass have we caught already? Who knows? We're gonna let him go now. Very little bass. He is aggressive. Oh, there's a bunch of ripples over there. It's like some little bait. Let's see if we can bring our lure right there. We got something. Yep, we got something. It's a little fish. Oh, I saw a blow up over there. These bass were eat feeding on that bait right there. Whatever it was moving the water so fast. Relax yourself, relax yourself. Very little bass. You can see all the movement there. They were feeding. I'm gonna put them back in now. The fish, the little drain pipe, there it is in front of me. There has to be a fish in there. That is the perfect cast to make to that drain pipe. Yep. There we go. There we go. I think it's a little one. Oh, and he came off. <laughs> we knew he was going to be in there. Look, we're going to swim right by there again. There's another hit. Oh, the fish was carrying it, you guys. I was so delayed on that hook set. That was another one. That lure went off to the right. I can't believe we messed up on that first one. And I think the bass were just sitting there by that drain pipe. It's always a drain pipe, you guys. I think water's coming through there. You can see the water moving down there. Maybe it comes from the other pond behind me. There we go. Ah, oh, That was a bite again. They're bringing that lure down. You guys, this drain pipe is no joke. The fish are loaded here. I say that, but look, we're not gonna get a bite now. Come on. There we go, there we go. That's a better one, you guys. This is the best one. That's the best one we've had. Oh, yeah, I hope he stays pinned. He's pulling drag. I'm gonna take off my bag real quick. Please stay pinned, please stay pinned. Whoo, he hammered it. 
best one of the day, you guys. He's hooked on top of the mouth. Oh, we don't want to lose you, boy. We do not want to lose you. He's very angry. Wow. Open your mouth fast. Open your mouth fast. Why can't I get him? Ooh, he tried to bite me. Best one of the day. Look, he's like... Oh, yeah, he's pinned pretty good on top of the mouth. You guys, that bass was angry. Oh, wow. We're going to have to get the pliers. He was not coming off. That's for sure. That is a very long bass. You can tell that bass is feeding down there. Kind of skinny, but very long. I don't even have my pliers on me. I should have had them on me. They're right here. Oh, that just popped off. I'm gonna have to zero out my scale with the grippers. Come on, bass. We gotta make this quick. We can't be showing everybody the juice. That is two pounds, two ounces. Pretty nice fish. Very aggressive, very aggressive. Some sharp gums on him too. He wanted that net rig, you guys. I'm gonna get a quick picture. You guys, we've had this fish out pretty long. Wonder if there's bigger ones like that. That is a nice fish. Please grow, become a bigger bass. There he goes. Oh, we are right next to that fountain. Oh, look at that. Bait fish. Something's feeding right here, literally, beneath my feet. There we go. There we go. He's swimming this way. Look at that. He bit it quick. Small little bass. Pretty fun though. We'll take it. Mm -hmm. Nice little bass. Throw him back in. There he goes. Oh, they bit it on the landing, you guys. He bit it on the landing. This is a good one. Whatever it is, it's not even coming up. It's swimming with it, it's swimming with it, it's swimming with it. Please be a bass. What is it? He's pulling hard, you guys. Wow. That is a good one. That is a big bass, you guys. Big bass. Big bass. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Check that out. This has to be a three. If it's not, I don't know what is. Very long, very wide. Oh look, that just popped right out of him. I was about to get the pliers on him. Man, I'm gonna take a picture real quick. That is a good one. Ooh. 
Oh, you guys, this is no joke. There are some good ones here. And to think, a pond within walking distance of me. My first time fishing here. Wow, that is exciting. All right, we're gonna get the quick weight on them. No, no, no. No, no, no. Can't believe I let them go. We cannot lose them. We gotta get a weight on them. Zeroing out the scale. Got them on the grippers now. Oh, it's not gonna be a three, you guys. 214. He has a lot of length to him. But he is not very big, I guess. That's pretty crazy. Very skinny, that's why. But he has a lot of length to him. Let's let him back in now. Very nice fish. Sharp gums on him. There he goes. You guys, I hope you can hear me over the water fountain. There's two of them here. You guys, I am speechless. Because I thought originally we were catching so many small fish over there on the net rig. I thought there would only be small ones here. But obviously this pond is going to be the better one than what was on the other side. The other side was real shallow. You guys, those are some big bass. I didn't think there would be some high twos in here. So they're roaming around. There has to be threes. And I am hoping there are fours. I'm pretty excited because these this pond here is pretty big. And it is in my neighborhood. That is exciting, you guys. I just moved here a month ago. We are going to catch many fish, you guys. This is the first day here. And we already caught two two-pounders, many bass, big bluegills. I'm going to keep fishing for a little bit and we're going to make our way back. we got to go eat dinner. You guys stay tuned. Alright you guys, let's keep casting. I can't believe the size that is in here. That's pretty exciting. There we go. This is a little one. Oh, it's a bluegill. Look at the colors on them. Wow, he's very bloody. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm yourself. Calm yourself. They're spining me. Wow, he looks a little sick, actually. All these little bumps on him. That's disgusting. Look at that. Like little red marks all over him. There he goes. I was like, no way something bit it. Oh, we scared something right here. Did we? Oh no, that was the lure. We were snagged on that opposite end. I think it was the concrete from that little tunnel thing. What do you call it? The drain pipe, not a tunnel. A little drain pipe. There we go. There we go. swimming this way oh he's a good one yep he's taking off you guys that bass hit it hard and he is pulling hard they're so angry in here Oh, he's flipping onto the land. Don't do that. No way he came off. You guys saw it though. Wow. I swear, I really do believe this hook has lost its sharpness. I've used it for so long now. It's not as sharp as it once was. many bass a couple of bluegill within a short period of time i think it was like exactly two hours pretty pretty sure that's what it was we caught about like 10 fish all the fish today were on this lure here that finesse trd that color is meat dog and i'll show it on the ned rig right here my medium heavy combo 15 pound fluoro that 
and I was able to catch those big bluegill. It was a bunch of big bluegill. Many little bass in this pond, but I was fishing that other side. This side is real shallow. I hope the water level picks up in here. I think only then will there be bigger ones in here. Look at all that grass. Can you imagine? These bass would live in all that. Anyways, if you enjoyed today's video, you guys, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.